This episode of Harry Potter Wizards Unite is brought to you by WB Games. Hey guys, welcome, welcome to another uh, Harry Potter Wizards Unite video, which is this one's brought to you by WB Games as well. As well. Literally, like they gave me the stuff for this video. So as you guys probably knew, um, on Tuesday I went out to Los Angeles to participate in the uh, Wizards Unite launch event, and then you know we got to play the game, meet with other uh, YouTubers and stuff, the developers, and uh, it was great. So. Um, after we left uh, Universal, they all gave us each a swag bag, which I thought was pretty interesting. So uh, let's let, let's get into this and uh, you know check out the contents of the bag. Um, first of all, before we get into the contents, we uh, there was like three stickers all around the place of the uh, statue of uh, Secrecy Task Force, which is pretty cool. Um, there's just all around tables and stuff. So there's that first. So that's it's probably the like the only one item that's like really related to the game, I guess. Uh, everything else is more Harry Potter stuff. So anyways, let's grab the bag. First of all, a decent bag. It doesn't have the logo on it or whatever, but um, hey, I'll take it. So anyways, um, let's start with the biggest thing that's sticking out of it. Um, this is a wand Luna Love Good, which I have to admit, I'm not the biggest Luna fan. Like, I, I don't get me wrong, I like Luna, but, like, I've seen Luna fans, and, like, I'd be ashamed to call myself a Luna fan. Like, Luna, people who, like, love Luna, really, really love Luna. But, um, hey, I, I, I'm, I'm happy with Luna. Um, I actually like Luna's wand a lot. I love Luna's design. I think Luna's wand's one of the better designed wands, um, in the franchise. So, um, let me attempt to open this first. So, alright, let's get that out of the way, and uh, here we go. Luna Lovegood's wand. There's that little uh, like flower thing at, uh, on the um, end of it. Um, not the longest one, or, you know, pretty thin one. Um, let's see, this is the... Um, is there any indication of which uh, series this is from? Oh well, whatever. But um, yeah, um, it starts, you know, your regular uh, uh, wooden one. And there's also whatever this is. I'll have to. I don't even know what this is. Um, it's something. Oh, it's. Oh, it has her <laughs> name tag on it. I think you could put it somewhere on the wand. I don't know. I don't know where though. Where would you put it? Here, I guess. Is this like some kind of stand that you could uh, stand the wand up on? Oh, get this out of the way first. Like maybe like, can you stand it up or lie it down? I guess, and then have like the Luna um, nameplate there. <laughs> like I, 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 this could be how it's used, or I could be um, totally wrong and it's just I don't know. <laughs> um, but hey, the wand. The wand's pretty great. Uh, her most part. Although, I would have to say, as beautiful as Luna's uh, wand looks, um, this part at the end, um, if you if you like hold it in certain ways, uh, it's actually decently... Sh it, well, it's not sharp, but like it still kind of hurts. Especially if you like pr press it a bit too hard. Um, it, it, it does have that drawback. So you just, you know, I guess just like grip it a bit further away um, from that. So. <laughs> so you don't hurt yourself in the process. Anyways, moving on. Uh, let's see, what else we got here? Um, let's take, let's take this one out. This is a um, little figurine of Rugus Hagrid, which, by the way, is the the um the first uh foundable that you find in the game in the tutorial uh hagrid get got a kind of some kind of was it a net or a web something something like that anyways um can i even open this <laughs> or is that even a question all right well oh, it's actually a bit difficult to crack open um there's actually five characters you got uh hagrid dumbledore weasley ron weasley um, Harry Potter and Hermione Granger, which unfortunately I didn't get. I didn't get Hermione, which I would. Oh my goodness! 
Yo, this is this is great. You got Hagrid, his um, his umbrella that he uses, which which is his wand. Spoilers, and also the uh, the birthday cake that he sat on when he first um, uh, visited uh, Harry in his little um. I was about to say living place, but you can't really live in some place like that. <laughs> Anyways, um, can I? Should have got scissors. All right, we finally freed Hagrid um, from the compoundable, which is this plastic um, uh, case. And um, yeah, it's, it's Hagrid. So there's that. Um, the birthday cake, I was... Can you fit, fit the wand in his hand at all? Well, not really. You know what, this is this is a missed opportunity. They could have made um, the, the space in, in his hand just a bit smaller so he could actually fit the wand slash umbrella in his hand. I tried my best. This is my own, my best attempt. And a birthday cake, which can you close it? No, you can't. Oh well, poor thing. Anyways, moving on. Let's put Rubius aside for a sec. Um, what else is in here? Ah, this is a big one. We got a Niffler plushie, which, like, uh, uh, when we first got the bags, I think, um, it, I think it was Brita, like, literally, like, screamed when she, when she saw this, like, because it, it, it was the most noticeable and largest. Oh, well, I don't know how you calculate um, size with this comparison to the wand box, but, um, one of the more larger, um, things that was in the bag, and, um, it's Niffler plushie, um, it's, um, uh, Crimes of Grindelwald as well, so, it ain't no, uh, regular Niffler, so, this one's great, um, my brother saw it and immediately wanted to take ownership of this one, but, um, sorry, I'm probably gonna keep this one for myself, and one last thing before we're done here, we have, oh, there's actually something in, in the back. Oh, uh, Horcrux bookmark collection. So, would expect something like a, a bunch of bookmarks shaped like Horcruxes, right? All right, how do you even get this? I can't, why is this so difficult? All right, there we go, wow. This is absolutely beautiful. This is great. So, bookmarks that are, you know, Horcrux shaped. And I might have just wrong direction. <laughs> uh, there we go, because that's bookmarks, you know, they go like that, right? Um, so here you got the Goblet of Fire. Um, what else you got? I guess, I guess this represents Nagini. Um, you got Harry, you got the, um, uh, the, the, the diary from Tom Riddle, the, um, the Ravenclaw cup thing, whatever. Um, and yeah, you got all the Horcruxes here, so there you go, um, as bookmarks, which is quite useful because, um, in Harry Potter's, there's a bunch of books, which you would, <laughs> you would use. Um, although these bookmarks are quite heavy in comparison to the paper ones I usually use. Um, but yeah, that's, uh, that's all here. Um, that's the last, last item that we've got. So we got bookmarks, we got Hagrid, we got a Niffler, and, uh, what was the last thing? Oh yeah, we got Luna's, we got Luna's wand, and also a lot of, um, trash I have to clean out in a second. So overall, a lot of great stuff in the um, the swag bag from um, WB Games. Again, thanks um, to WB Games and Niantic for inviting me over and providing us with uh, this uh, this bunch of stuff, good stuff. And um, you know what? Like almost like the swag bag alone might almost just be worth the trip. So, anyways, um, that's gonna be it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I am um, filming this on the night of the. The, the 20th. So hopefully, by the time this one's uploaded and published, hopefully Wizards Unite would be available in Canada, because if you guys don't know, um, they released it in the UK and the US first. So hopefully Canada would be there soon. Um, come on, guys. You, you, you can't shaft the North twice in a row. 
Um, I think Pogo was like eleven days uh, later um, than 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 US uh, when when it was released. Uh, but then again, you know, can't complain too much. At least we weren't uh, poor South Korea and Russia, which was South Korea was like almost a year later, and Russia was like two years later. But um, yeah, hopefully the game comes out. In the meantime, I've got stuff to work with um, myself and. That's me for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. You can also follow me on Twitter. Uh, I tweet a lot of random stuff if you are into random stuff. So that's me here, and I'll see you guys in the next video, which hopefully by then the game would come out in Canada.